No, oh, Jesus, Eric. She didn't steal anything. She just told you, man. Calm down. You see a smirk? You ever caught someone lying to you? Ooh, I like this. I like how especially he's gonna create scenarios for the strangers. Eric just exposed a bunch of liars in public for 6 million people to watch, which is a lot of views for a short amount of time. Let's figure out how he went so viral. <laughs> Start with those scumbags who put soda in water. <laughs> I used to you're do not that. that guy, are you? Please tell me you're not that guy. I mean, uh, go to Taco Bell, you get Baja Blast in the water cup all the time. I like how they ramp their production up, and that means that they are now traveling around in a van and putting cameras in places for public to see. In terms of uh, scoring, we're going to see how many people are losers in this situation, I guess. But we are literally exposing along with him. The counter serving everyone. <laughs> Jonah from uh, actually Jonah David Dobrik's vlogs that are no longer existing. On a water cup? Yes, please. I'm going to write water cup. I like how he just sassily told him to use it for water. Oh, wow. More honesty than truth so far. Oh, just kidding. I feel the same way, Eric, but actually, this is what he All wants right, us to water. see. These ramping up of lies and truths from these different people, especially in a closed quarters like this. Nowhere to go. Oh my gosh, she's like a school principal yelling at a student. <laughs> he has the baton, did you see it? Oh no. Ah. Uh. <laughs> and they're all just staring at him. How would you feel if some random guy that looks like that just went up to you and started hitting you with a baton? Here we go. This Watch hard. out. This guy just took soda, but we are also two minutes in, which means that we're ramping up the lies. It's one location. How do we make this interesting, Eric? But we have the boys to do that. They're basically harassing all of the customers. In your content, what kind of bits can you portray like this? How obnoxious can you be for the, uh, the certain ideas that you behold? Turn around. Mac might catch a fist. See, I mean, it's literally like you could get arrested doing that. Over a water cup, this is pretty dramatic stuff. This almost feels like reality TV in terms of how far can they take it. The lies are still winning. We gotta get those truths. Up. But the dude that they're with looks like a really weird uncle. Oh my god, he got him by the neck. He threw it in his face and choked him and screamed at him. Could you imagine a guy that looks like that getting crazy on you like that? So I rinsed out this they have so many cameras everywhere. Plus that room looks really worn down. So awkward. And he's just tired of it. Mac is tired of it. Oh, here we go. It's happening. This is like messed up though because they're working for a living. And are they going to take the money? There's a Starbucks cup. They can afford that loss. She's literally trying everything but except taking that. Ooh, she made it dark first. That is devious. He outsmarted them. All the money's gone. He's speechless, but I'm not. That's you, crazy. I thought that she was of good morals. This time I hid 30,000. And there you go with the stacks. I hope they're fake. Oh, shit. I'm not touching that. <laughs> she thinks it's like drug money, I bet. Not touching it. She doesn't want anything to do with that. so funny. Everybody is just lying. I would totally not lie. Lunch break. I wonder what they ate. Looks like some gourmet steak. <laughs> they're all just listening into the conversation. He's dropping is different. That's just like, you gotta just, come on, don't. don't. Oh my Dude. gosh. He literally just put a bunch of spit on his food. He's cutting up his steak. He's ready. He wants to tell him, come on. He's not gonna tell him. Oh my gosh. No. That guy's not your friend, Iraq. He's kind of red handed, though. Come on. It's kind of depressing that everybody's lying. Okay, well, actually, in this case, they look like they're all friends. So I don't even know if I'd bring that up, actually. If it was my friend and I was pretty close with him, that's exactly how Iraq and how we should all segue into our segments. We're going to find out exactly how many of these people are willing to cheat on the test. I definitely would, though, because me and school did not get along. I was making videos. Oh my gosh, that classroom. It just looks exhausting. Like, you just want to fall asleep in there. These people are willing to to cheat on a test. Did you? I, yeah, you did. Come on. Out of hand. I literally feel like I'm a spy. Okay, but why is that computer from 1980s? Sent correct. They're gonna give you guys. Dang, that's a lot of money. There's a bunch of different aged people there. I don't think that they're all gonna assume it's just a prank. Some of them might actually want the thousand dollars. I think he's turned them over. So let's see how many people actually lie for it. <laughs> He's like, what do I do? I should use what I've been given, right? They all are, though. Yeah, if they had left, wouldn't you? So many liars in one room. Does anybody have any respect? No, we don't. Not too good. So when you're working off of an overarching idea, you need tension and release points. Where all of these personalities are making the same bad decision in one go. Is there anybody that wants to fess up? And Eric is just left there, in misery. Nobody wants to come out and say the truth. 
Hey, now we're actually even, and it's high. What are the odds of this? For our last stop, this restaurant. Tyler's busy driving over here with his girlfriend because Tyler and his girlfriend are gonna sit. Dang, he's going after somebody's girlfriend. That's harsh. Sam loves stealing. I would take silverware too. That stuff is expensive, and the places that you can go to to get that stuff, well, they're they're fancy places. <laughs> so she just regularly steals stuff then. Yes. Yes. Yeah, there are way better ways to approach for somebody who lies. This is intense. This is like, oh my god, that's all it took for them to start taking things? And she's like, I want them. She already decided. Oh my gosh. She might just steal his wallet. And she's still going? No! Going on a date, being in a relationship, that stuff is intimate. And you want to get to know that person. That means a lot. And when somebody is... Stealing? I don't know if I would feel comfortable being around this person actually. So awkward. That is so weird. Getting caught. I have 100% fork. You took a fork? Dang, that is so much. See, at that point, you just should be embarrassed. But he hit a trend with an amazing thumbnail and did it in three different ways in one video.